More than 20 years of the making coming true tonight in Bay Minette. Fox 2 News was there as the ribbon was cut on a brand new sports complex. Our Lee Peck with the story. One, two, three, cut it. Let the games begin. Bay Minette's new sports complex is open for play. I pledge allegiance to the flag the United States of America. For the inaugural games, each of the four new fields has a special passing of the softball to the younger generation. Susan Thompson is handing it off to her granddaughter, Emma. These girls right here, this is why I do it. I love it. I wouldn't trade it for the world. In addition to the four 300-foot softball fields, the $2.7 million complex has a two-story concession stand and batting cages. Copy, ready to back up the a far cry from the smaller park they outgrew years ago. I've been with the city 29 years and I've been wanting this day to get here ever since then. I just, I'm speechless. It's just, it's just a dream come true. Bay Manette kicking off the first weekend right as they're set to host a state tournament, giving them some return on their investment. And that's something we had in mind is, you know, frankly, we expect this to generate revenue by being able to host those big tournaments, which we have not been able to do before now. So. It's a proud moment for the players, too. They're so pretty. Yeah, they're really nice. I like them. Fun on the diamond and the start of many precious memories to come. It's, it's good because when I get older, I can tell my kids I was the first one to play on the field. It's a big deal. Yep. Fields that were once just dreams, now a reality. In Bay Manette, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News. Well, Bay Manette expects at least 50 teams from all over the state for that weekend tournament coming up.